Hey guys, it's Stoney here, and I'm in a tuxedo, but it doesn't matter for this mod review because today we're going to be taking a look at a Villager Mincer mod, and essentially what it does is that this awesome item alongside with some other items that I'm going to show you later, uh, but this is the Super Mincer, and essentially it allows you to blend the villagers, like you put food in a blender, you put villagers in villager, um, in Super Mincers, I mean, and it'll pretty much shred them to pieces, and... Uh, yeah, you will get some villager meat, you heard me right, villager meat, so you can be a cannibal in this game. Yeah, uh, also you'll get some emeralds alongside with a villager meat, so that's kind of awesome. But actually guys, before I start this mod showcase, I wanted to ask you if you would like to see some Skyrim mods maybe on my channel in the future, because I will need to record 9 videos in only 2 days, so that's gonna be a rough time, and if you wanna see some scary mods in those 7 to 9 days, uh, that'd be great, it'd make my life much easier, and yeah, I do love Skyrim. Oh, uh, why am I getting lag spike, doesn't even matter. Alrighty, uh, now before I actually show you how you will shred villagers to pieces, let me actually show you how to make the super mincer. So, <laughs> this is a recipe for two of them, so you only need nether quartz, emeralds, and iron ingots, so actually only one emerald. So this is the recipe for it, and you will get two of those. So, now what you do with two of those, you put them basically on top of each other, but if you don't place them on top of each other, they don't really do much, so, which I will show you later. Um, I'm not really sure what you use to break it. Uh, it's probably a pickaxe, but yeah, it doesn't really matter. And if you're wondering a bit about, about this diamond glaive or whatever it's called, it, that's from another mod. <laughs> so these are all the other items that it adds, but I'm going to go over them later. So first of all, uh, what I'm going to show you is how it actually looks like when the villagers become pieces of villager meat. All right, come on, come on, yeah. D don't be shy, don't be shy. I only want to shred you to pieces. There we go, not a baby, not... Alrighty, that's how you shred villagers to pieces. There we go. Oh, <laughs> wow. Okay, so we got 38 strange meat and four. All right. Oh no, not the baby. I didn't want to do this to the baby. Oh man, I feel cruel now. But yeah, I got meat. I got a lot of meat and 25 emeralds from only two big villagers. Actually, even more meat. Oh my god, it's oh god. I didn't even know if I want to eat it, but I'll, I'll just eat it to show you what I get. Uh, so I get a lot of random effects. Well. They're not really random, I get nausea and I get hunger too. Um, yeah, that's really not that great, is it now? Uh, what you will really want to make is an empty can. Uh, actually, I'm not sure if you want to make it, but yeah, we'll figure that out later. So this is an empty can, this is the recipe for it, you will only need three hours. How did this guy escape? You you think you can escape me? You think you can do that? Alright, 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 you think you can escape, alright? Alright, no one escapes Tony. No one. Not even you. Hey, Tom the Cactus. No, no one escapes Tony. You're gonna become pieces of villager meat. And then, bro, thank you for that. Man. No one escapes my cage. No one, not even you. And this is a Japanese mod, and Tom the Cactus actually uh, speaks Japanese, so that's kind of good. So he actually uh, taught me what the mod does. And yeah, thank you, Tom, the awesome cactus. No Already, throw. moving on. Uh, once you make the empty can, you will want to make the meat can. Just two strange meat on top of each other and uh, an empty can below it. And you will actually be able to eat it. So let me eat it and see what it does. So I get hunger 3 now instead of hunger 2. And I get nausea 2. Uh, this is what nausea 2 looks like. So it's like you're on an LSD trip. Oh, damn! All right, uh, and you get an empty can back now. Oh my god, this is so trippy. I, I just have to take the milk now. I can't take it later. I, oh god, thank you, thank you so much for the milk. All right, uh, next one is the emerald can. So you will need strange meat, emeralds, and an empty can, and you will get an emerald can. Now, um, progressively, these get these get worse and worse. So I'm not really sure why I would like to make them, but then again, I'm not even sure why would you would want to eat the villager meat. So that's. What? I didn't get poison from it? I should get I should I should get boot poisoning from this. What okay, th this is really strange now. <laughs> Whatever. But uh, guys, this is also a really cool way of getting emeralds so now you can just get a lot of stuff, so yeah, for basically for free. Well not really for free, but you get what I mean. Um you'll you will need to make these. <laughs> now once you eat the emerald can, let me see what happens. Uh I get hunger three, poison two, and nausea two. Well, no, oh my god, it... <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna take the milk. And last, but definitely not least, we have these two. Uh, I'm gonna show you the Super Emerald Can later. First, I'm gonna show you the Emerald Gun. 
Uh, and for the emerald gun, you will need two emeralds, three uh, nether, nether quartz, and uh, one, uh, I mean, two iron ingots. Uh, and you will need nether, uh, what, nether? You will need emeralds to shoot them. So uh, emeralds are like the bullets. So I'm gonna need a lot more emeralds. So come on, come on, don't be shy, villagers. I just want your emeralds. I don't want your meat. I don't, I don't care about your meat. You think you're going to, okay, you can run away, whatever. I, I don't really care. I just need emeralds. Oh my god, emeralds for days. This is so weird. I'm just taking their meat. I don't want villager meat. I only want the emeralds. Oh man, I feel cruel. I feel cruel. I don't want the babies. Okay, this is enough. This is enough. I don't want to torture you guys anymore. This is... Oh my god, I felt like a cannibal. This is... Oh my god. All right. I have a more than a stack of emeralds. I don't want this strange meat. Oh my god damn it. But then you can use the guns and shoot him. And, um... I want of you now. So now, when I eat your strange meat, I am basically am a cannibal. Yeah, even though you can't really see my animation. <laughs> but as you, oh, what? I took a screenshot. Well, whatever. Doesn't even matter. Are these mating? Are you guys mating? Well, it would be a shame if someone broke you up. And I became a villager again. What? I am one of you now, and I am gonna kill you. Why am I becoming a villager all over again when when I kill him? Okay, this, maybe only because I'm taking. <laughs> Other forms of villagers, the blue ones and the little What if I kill a baby villager? I'm not gonna morph into it, am I? Well, this gun is really fun to play with, but guys, last but definitely not least, I will show you the super emerald can. I wanna get rid of all of these. This is the recipe for it. So we'll need sugar, strange meat, emerald can, two dirt, and one emerald. So I'm not really sure why you would eat two dirt and one emerald alongside with sugar, but I'm gonna stay right here with the cute little villager babies, and I do hate villagers, as all of you may know, or may not know. And I'm gonna drink this, or eat it, or... Yeah, this happens. Uh, I should have been dead. I have poison for almost... Uh, I mean, 10 minutes. And, yeah, if I would take off my suit, uh, and if it wasn't unpeaceful, I would suffer a terrible, terrible death. Uh, luckily, you don't get... Poison can't really kill you. But what if I would go to hard mode? But uh, poison still won't kill me. Uh, the little villager is alive and... Um, yeah, this is what the super emerald can does. So, I'm not really sure why you would want to use it. But, yeah, this is a big explosion of freaking creeper. But guys, that is pretty much it. I hope you have all enjoyed. Don't forget to tell me about the Skyrim mods. Uh, what do you think about that in the in the comment section down below? And if you're new to the channel and like the commentary, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace.